UNICEF 2024. All right, so in goal, David James, uh, a back four of Sam Quek, Stuart Broad, Gary Cahill, and Danny Dyer. Surprise inclusion there, uh, as is Sam Thompson, who was over the moon on left wing. Jill Scott, the skipper in the middle of the park with Jack Wiltshire. Tom Grennan down the right, last has been uh, player of the match for the last two soccer aids. Uh, the goalie, obviously the legend start in the first half, that's better check. Uh, the back four. The Celtic Cafu, Martin Compton, Roman Kemp and Ever in the middle of the park. Surprise choice, Scanlon. Uh, good for him, uh, Emmett, and left back. Midfield, what a midfield. Michael Essie and Del Piero and Hamare. And then up front, Lemak, Usain Bolt. And answering the question, who would be running one-on-one -on -one at Danny Dyer? It turns out the answer is Eden Hazard. <laughs> <laughs> the World eleven. Getting stuck in to Thompson. Good break. Grennan into Ellen White. And Ellen White's effort goes narrowly over the top of the bar. And they're targeting Tom Grennan. And Rebecca Welsh, who is our referee, very experienced referee, took charge of this year's Women's Champions League final with her team, Natalie Aspinall and Emily Carney, and the fourth official, Jane Sims. It's a soccer aid. It's a lovely ball in by Wilshire, taken down beautifully by Joe Cole. Come back to her in just a second. Hazard. Oh, no. to Usain Bolt. Oh, he thinks he should have connected with that. Had a bit of thigh injury this week, but had his treatment. Ellen White trying to stay on side. Grennan keeps going. He shot through the gap. It's Tom Grennan. It's White. He will not be happy about that, let me tell you. This is Eddie Hazard. Lovely turn away from Jill Scott. Lane then. We you say that. Trying to take on Danny Dyer. Wow. Well, the referee's blown the whistle. It's going to be a free kick. But he pulled no punches there, Danny Dyer. And he's, he's certainly been active so far tonight. And he's going towards the near post. And James can't keep it out. And Edin Hazard is on the score sheet. The support for him is like a form of worship. And no wonder, because Stamford Bridge is once again the Garden of Eden. So please, if you can get involved, text 40, 30, 20 or 10 to 70818. And I think as well, oh, here we go. Bolt skinning broad. He's got Alessandro Del Piero. Available, willing and able. That's a lovely finish. Combination played for the two strikers there. And it goes to the children that need it the most. Scott. Thompson keeps it alive. And it wasn't far away from Sam Thompson. That would have capped his week. Del Piero. England do have Jermaine Defoe on the bench and Theo Walcott as well, who we'll see a little bit later on. Here's Joe Cole, and he's fed Jack Wilshire. Wilshire trying to get it onto his left foot, sits the keeper down. Great. a beautiful goal as well. Lovely work done that right-hand side. Ellen White, Lioness legend, all-time top scorer for the Lionesses. And that allowed Everett to find Eddie Hazard. This is Ward centering it Great towards ball. Usain Bolt. Somehow Paddy McGuinness has made another save. What a stop this is from Paddy McGuinness. I tell you what, you know, look at that again, Usain Bolt. No likey. Ernst's first touch feeds Defoe. And he's held onto it well. Bartlett wants it played down the left. He missed Soccer Aid last year. He's got Walcott open in the centre. Oh. Oh. Spit that diary of the CEO. That is lovely. Robbie's feeling real love. But he's been on the pitch a matter of moments, and he has produced this.
It's a lovely finish. He's just hit it as hard as he can at Tony, and he's found the space between Tony's legs. Tony's still furious with himself. But there's no need to be. That's just bad luck. Well, he didn't see Bartlett coming. He's made a good contribution, Stephen Bartlett, so far. So is Defoe. And here's Grennan. Defoe. Still going. Oh, dear. oh Bolts pulled up. And Defoe. 4 2 to England. And maybe those five years of hurt are coming to an end. It's not looking great. It was a beautiful solo goal by Jermaine Defoe. And what a goal scorer Jermaine Defoe is. Returning for only the second time since he scored twice in 2016. Defoe chipping it over the top for Bartlett, who's in behind again here. It's Stephen Bartlett and Tony Bellew with another very good stop. Trying to tease it towards the far post, and it was a brilliant bit of defensive play by Michael Essien, who watched it, read it, dealt with it. I had a feeling I saw Theo eye it up. That's phenomenal. That's the game of his head twice. <laughs> what is that with your thighs? I just, I just feel a bit, you know, I just sometimes get a bit claustrophobic up here. I'm just listening off, that's all. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just in case. You never know. Just in case what? I don't know. Ball loose inside the penalty area, the ricochet's going to go over the line! Bartlett's done it again! England have a three-goal lead! Oh, look, Garcia's effort has bounced almost kindly for Wingrove. Oh, now, was there a drag back? There was, and Brazier has pulled down Patrice Ever, it's a penalty. Patrice gets the better of Bobby Brazier, and there's hands on the shot. That is a pull, that is a penalty. For the room growth from the spot. A freestyler called up to replace Roberto Carlos. A chance to drag Soccer A World Eleven back in it, giving them a bit of hope. Bosch! Scoring past the stranded Paddy McGuinness. Well, a little Sue at the end. You love to see it. And we're back to two again. England five, the Soccer Aid World 11 3. England have been without a victory for a long time. Walcott trying to seal it. He might just have done. Fed by Carney, finished by Walcott. Walcott takes the acclaim. And Sterling maybe should have saved his legs. This is Ashley Cole, Theo Walcott on the dart, but Michael Essien cut off the pass. Defoe grappling with Olga Garcia and spotting Bartlett, who's on a hat trick. It's Stephen Bartlett. It's a stunning Tony Bellew save. Denying the Dragon's Den start with a super stop. Uh, the last manager to lead England to victory at Soccer A was Sam Allardyce. The last player to score a winner was Blake Harrison. Today, England grab the <laughs> Soccer A trophy back from the World Eleven and restore some pride to the three Lions. Robbie Williams celebrates Frank Lampard, has had some tough jobs in management, but turning this lot around is a bit of a triumph. Five long years, five soccer aids, where at times they never look like winning, but they have today. They want Robbie to get involved. Frank Lampard will do it with Jill Scott, the England captain. They raise the soccer aid trophy into the sky, and after 2001,